looking right here. And uh, the quarterback looking to his right, but finally threw to his left. But there were two guys out there trying to block Watson by Ula, but he split the defenders and made the tackle. And Vic, that's why Yavia Manuma was shaking his head like, how can two guys uh, be this unable to block one guy? <laughs> Third and one. Warriors, Lupa Yamika still behind the center. Fullback gets a call. Number 30. He gets a good game. Alfred Seui. Backup fullback for the Tafuna Warriors. He's got the first down. Leyato on the tackle, number 72 for the Vikings. Leyato, Leyato playing way down there on the backside of that defense. He's a defensive lineman, but he chased the play down. Yeah, il tato kwata momua, fesu ya ifo ya itu al malai. Ya tulang or tato ayus or talonga sfun malfa tafuna. Ya eli tawa ilava fon itu al temin nei. It's been all tafuna up to now in this first quarter. Maybe perhaps uh, the second quarter will be fon itu al quarter. Well, let's just wait and see. They need to make something happen on defense. Either a turnover or an interception would help them. Well, the offense, they need to, to step up. They're not giving you enough time for the defense to uh, take a break. Here comes the Warriors. New player, Mika, the QB, looking to throw. We have we a have whistle. A whistle and a flag. Okay, come back five. Head official. Prior to the snap, dead ball foul, offside on the offense. Five yards, replay first down. Penalty against the Warriors. That's a huge offensive line here for the Warriors. That's why they're been blocking well. Here's Quick the pass. Rico. Ball is tipped, incomplete. Look at that huge offensive line. They're huge, but they're doing a good job. Oh, they're, they're opening very, up those holes. It, it looks the, like they're very mobile as well. They've been pulling on the blocks. They've been running downfield. That's the key to everything, because you can't start anything unless you have a good yeah, offensive, an line. offensive line. Second and long. Manuma. Gives it to Via Via. This is the first time he'll be tackled for a loss in for this game. Loss. Finally, the Vikings penetrate that offensive line and make the tackle. Let's see who got there first. It was number 72. That's Leyato. That's Leyato. Jeffrey Totu and Francis Leyato. Jeffrey Totu making a, a tackle there That's, well, along with Leyato. Finally, they penetrate that offensive line because they're huge. And those two guys, uh, Jeffrey and uh, Leato, they're, they're pretty pretty huge. They're pretty, pretty yep. big themselves as well. So maybe we got the matchup right here. If they could do that. Third and long. They could make a difference. Jasper in motion. Fake handoff. Here comes the containment. Ooh, they go well. right by him, but he finally gets tackled by Leato again. Leato again. Number 72. There were two guys out there to make the tackle on him, but... Uh, Lupa Yamika ducked and they missed. They missed on but the first. 72 didn't miss. <laughs> Here's another look at the replay. Here comes the, con uh, the containing guys on the outside. They're supposed to make this tackle, but they go missed right, right by him. there him. and 72. Good thing Leyato was there. Tafuna getting ready to punt. Big stop on defense for the Vikings. A high snap. Here comes trouble for the Warriors. You got to do something about it. And he Finally gets it to his left boot. And he did the best he could because he had no chance whatsoever. <laughs> and he's not even a left bootish uh, kicker right there. And that's all he could do. Well, he's a, he's a rugby player, so he's got to be good in both legs. Well, he didn't do good right there. <laughs> you know, the rugby ball is a bit bigger <laughs> than a regular than American football. football you know? <laughs> well, Faraito will take over on down first and ten. Good look at the packed crowd here at Veterans Stadium. Number six coming in late there with the play. Number nine, 
Yes, correct. I was just trying to check the number. And it looks like we got a new quarterback for the Vikings. We got a new quarterback, but we don't have his name on the, on the roster again for the uh, Fun Like Tour Vikings. Number nine? Where have they been hiding number nine? Could he be the quarterback for the JV? I have no idea. Number nine takes, takes the ball. It up the it looks like he's very mobile. But we don't have they a name it. for they him. They got that first down. We got to give credit where credit is due, and we'd like to know the name of number nine. We're sorry we don't have his name on the roster. Families and friends are watching. And he kind of moves about like Ricardo Gonzalez. So, um, what, a change of jersey? Maybe a change of jersey. <laughs> Well, we'll get his name made on. Look at this kid, Tai Matuya. Again, all the way the from the left, uh, right side, making that tackle. But well, we're going to find out who we might have found. Tai Minero, CDP, I have found. Swimmer far, it is a young guy. Quarterback keeps it, goes on the option, cuts it upfield. That's pretty good running right there. Still on the running, and he lost the ball. Again, a loose ball, and Tafuna comes up with it. What a good gain on that run, but too bad he couldn't hold on to that football. Number 21, it's Augusto Canales. I don't know if I'm, you know, it might have been number 99 again on that tackle, chasing the play from behind, but the quarterback should have done better holding on. Here's another look. Now, this is a good decision right here. He went on the option, then he sees that the pitch man was covered, so he cut it right back up, and look at this good gain right here. But in this uh, point right here in the run, He's got to take care of the football, but he comes he loose. Number out. 99 was there again. He lost his helmet again. That's correct. <laughs> I think his helmet is a bit loose right there. He's got to get a good fitting helmet. Talking about patient on the run, this number nine can do that. Yeah, but well. he lost the football, yeah. though. And oh, Here's here comes number four, the Philo Samoa. He's got blockers up front. A lot of room there. All kinds of, uh, he finally gets chased from behind number nine. He's too disappointed. Because he should have trailed, the, he should have blocked the trailing Fangai to a player. Fangai to a number 15. Here's another look at the Jericho replay. Bali. Good job by the guys in the truck. Great blocking out front. Good blocking. Now look at number 92 right there. He's got nothing to block right here. He should have just peeled back. And there's a trailing player right here, but he couldn't get there to <laughs> block him. <laughs> but good run there. It's interesting to call somebody else's name instead of Via Via Manuma because Via. it's always been Via Via Manuma yeah. for the Warriors. For the first quarter and for the Warriors. Favau Big first down. Favau Pedro's fighting a tough one. Pui Pui Mai Fangai Tua. Another handoff. Good tackle. Ball carrier number 30. Number 30. I don't, know what, say, ui. I don't know what number 30 is complaining about. He was pointing to his lower uh, feet right there, probably saying that the guy tackled me too low. <laughs> Is there a rule against that? I don't think so. He's got the football with him. Hey, buddy. As long as somebody don't grab his well, collar, but I, going I, no. As long as you got that. that football, man, you're, you're game. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe he's got a different rule book that he probably looked at because he was pointing to something. Here comes the Warriors. Nupoy Mika gives it to his tailback. Uh, number seven. Number seven. Oh. Finally gets tackled. By, by number, number 28. Nehemiah Tiapula. That's Beaver Ho Ching. It's interesting. Beaver that's Ho Ching. Your, that's your second string quarterback they're using as a running back. He hasn't been playing quarterback, but they're utilizing but he's their, him yeah, as a running back. But he's your second string quarterback. What would happen if Nupoy Mika would get injured? Yep. No, but the interesting thing I was trying to point out on Mamo is, where is Vivian Manuma? Is he injured? Is that why we're not seeing him? Or they're giving Beaver Ho Ching some time to play? Now, just as I said that, they gave me the answer. Manuma is right back on the is field. Back in. Guess who will get this football? A quick pass. It's a quick throw on the slant. He's got it. Jasper with the reception there. As it looks like by Ula Watson on the tackle. Look at Jasper right here, comes in the slant. That's a quick slant, three-step, and come in right there. 
Good opening. All good right. reception there. That's a good tackle by Viola. I thought it was, it was early in the tackle, but no, it was perfect. Here comes Second the Warriors. Second one. Vivian Manuma gets Vivian away. Manuma. Look at him run. He should have been tackled for either a short gain or a loss. A loss. But he got away. All he needs is that just little opening. Here's another look at this play right here. And I'm going to point out what should happen right here. It's just a simple toss. He should be tackled right, right here. here. But look at that inside step right there. That gets him away. 55 making that tackle from behind. Vincent Taala on the stop for the Vikings. The defense for the Vikings right now, they're definitely in some serious trouble here. Trying to stop this uh, offense, especially via Via Manuma. He's a shifty running back, so very tough to stop him because he could shift left, right, he could shift Sit left. left. And, and then he's got the burst of speed, just, just got to accelerate. He's a quick throw, he's got his man, and he's got room, he will score. That's number 12. Number 12. That's our Pedro Suarez Malilani. And a touchdown for Tafuna. Here's another look at this play. Our Pedro was all by himself. The cornerback was playing off of him, so the Warriors took advantage of that. How can you play off of your receiver when you're that close to the end zone? <laughs> I don't know. Mayao for the extra point. Kick is up. Kick is up. And that he is, is good. good. He's perfect. Three for three. Three for three. Tafuna now 21. Vikings yet to score. Our time remaining in the second quarter. Six minutes, 11 seconds. Ono minute suma jasi sekondi olo toi tatu kwata lona lua. Mai ai male afa momua. Yeah, it's a way lava if my two are banging near Tatu Talonga or Aye Tafuna. Yeah, well, say it to me, Lewis Summa Tassi. The Warriors are um, pouring it on in this second quarter. We're still in the first half, and they've scored three times against this very good defense. The thing about Tafuna, when they take Via Via out and they bring a backup uh, running back, it's they do the same thing. Well, sometimes they use Via Via as a decoy, and that's also worked for uh, number four. A, a good look at the packed crowd here at Veterans Stadium. Everybody coming here to cheer the team on. Huh? Good crowd here at uh, Veterans Memorial Stadium as Tafuna is getting ready. Destiny Vial for the kickoff. Opusili waiting for Kick that football. Up he should high. try to make something happen here. Opusili gets it. Comes inside. And Great pursuit by that special teams with the Warriors. They did not give. 75. Lene Mayava. They did not give Upusili any, any chance, chance whatsoever to, to get a running start because Patrick Upusili's got some speed. Oh, yeah. But he, here comes the uh, Vikings, first and 10. They got to make something happen here. Again, number nine, the QB. I, I tell you, he does look like Ricardo Gonzalez. He may have changed his jersey. He, he is Gonzalez. It is Gonzalez with a change of jersey. Well, it is Gonzalez, number nine. That's what I was saying when I seen him say, it does look like Ricardo Gonzalez, only for the number. I think. They ripped his jersey in that first quarter. First one, because uh, he wears number three. Number three, correct. Now you triple that number three and you get a nine. <laughs> it's a first. We were right. We changed the jersey. That's right. We're pretty good, huh? <laughs> in identifying players. <laughs> first and ten. First and ten, Vikings. Here comes the Vikings. Inside, no recover. Keeps, keeps it on the option. Pitch it out. Ooh. Oh, my goodness, the defense for the Warriors are on fire. Jericho Vawali was tackled there by number 16. They're playing the quarterback, they're playing the pitch, man. The Vikings cannot seem to get anything going right now. The momentum is on Tafuna's side. Malaki Pitoitua. Warriors are very focused right now on this game. Here comes Ricardo looking to throw, throws it short. Gets it to Upusili. Upusili. Upusili stops in his tracks right there. Still third and long. Look at the way the defense for the 
Warriors there in Amuamo swarming to the football. I mean, one guy would miss, and then a couple of guys, guys come in. Guys will, will back up. Amu. This is an awesome way that defense is playing right now. That's why the Vikings are finding it difficult to make anything happen. Opusili. He got tripped on that run. Fourth and long, and Faitua decide to punt. Playing it safe here. They're still on their side of the football field. And with the way things have been going, the coach is deciding to do a punt the football away and have the Warriors make the mistakes. All they need right now I'm almost, is a good snap because anything can happen. The punter calling for the snap right here. He's about 13 snap yards deep. Kick is up. Number 32 could not hang on to that football. Yeah, he touched it, but then finally, finally recovered, he recovered it. Recovered it. Such a funnel more. The Vikings cannot buy a turnover right here. The Warriors able to get back on that football. It should have been a clear cut finally to a football with the way things were, but they were slow in the chase. Yeah, so you ever touch talon or not a town five maya tafuna puya to fang it to no lure tato talon a mata ina. Still running First and ten for the Warriors. Quarterback hands it off to his running back. Finally gets tackled number, number six. six. What's it by Ula on a, on a tackle for Fana Tua? We got four minutes remaining. Five minutes left to go. That's all. Afa Mumua. Malu na malu na chunu olo mai mo ina ne talonga. Fatu muli ya umu fale matu matu talonga matu ngofie. Ah, talonga matu ina. That's all. Four minutes left. Lava lava and tongue. Five minutes left. Two. That's all. Afa lono lua. Ola. Jesus swing. Oh, very nice swing. I'm not touching. Quick throw. Quick throw to the left. He's got his man. Jasper finally gets tackled. By Vaiula. Number seven. Another first down for the Warriors. With that good reception by Jasper Mikaeli. Vikings are delivering the solid blows, uh, Amo Amo, but the Warriors are the ones gaining the yards. That was a good job by Jasper there, just holding on to the football after that hard hit. Hard hit by Watson. First and ten for the Warriors. We have Manu Ma in motion. Looks like he's going to play him as a receiver. Uh, we have a whistle. That's the first time they're going to play Manu Ma right there. They also played them in the screen pass. Prior to the snap, dead ball foul, offside on the offense. Five yards, replay first down. Pasalaina <laughs> ya Tafuna. Another whistle again. Prior to the snap, dead ball foul, offside. In the Same offense. Penalty. Five yards, we play first down. Time out, Tafuna. Yeah, but we know if we need to make a mistake, we can make a mistake. Well, that should be a good time out because if you get penalized for four start twice, two consecutive times, that you need to call a time out and have the guys settle down. And it's the same penalty. I think outside. they're I think they're too pumped up for this game. Too psyched up. <laughs> yeah, I think I think they're too pumped up because of number 99 on that defense. Yep. Trying, he, he's trying to motivate that offense, and it, the offense doesn't need any motivation. They scored 21 points already. Terminewa, <laughs> 
Quarterback looking to throw short three step drop. He missed his target. Again, another slant pattern. They've been using that pattern a whole lot. You know why, Felicia, last week we talked about this, right? Yeah. The way Fangai Tua likes to blitz. And we always talked about when they played other teams that said, like, every time the, 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 the linebacker goes on the blitz, that middle portion is open. It's open. And then we said that the slant pattern slant is open. Will work. And it's been working for the Warriors. It is. It, it's, it's, it's working for because the Warriors. Because the linebacker should stay there and take that away. And, and Fungai Tua is still doing that uh, blitzing up. Up, right up the middle. That's why they're sending the guy in on a slant, and it works. It does work with that big cap there. That's why the strong safety needs to step up. Here comes Vivian Manumar. Here Manuma. comes again. that favorite play of his again, and he gets a good gain on it. Finally brought down by number... I believe that's 54. 54, Tito Falolongo. Falo Longo. Again, we called his name. It's been a while since we last called his name on that run. Third and ten. Third and ten for the Warriors. And now Via Via is heading back out. Two minutes remaining. Two minutes, 19 seconds remaining in this first half. So, you have nine minutes to turn my life from Momua. You have a little South Pelos for Atafuna. Back to pass. It looks like early movement by the tight end for the Warriors. He might have been the target for this pass because he was quick off the blocks. Right to the snap, dead ball foul, offside on the offense. Five yards, replace third down. It wasn't by same much. Call. It wasn't by much, but the tight end was a bit early right there, and I bet you he was a target of that throw. It might have been a tight end pop. Because that's another play you can run when the, the middle linebacker goes on the blitz. Here's another look at the play. Let's, see. Long. Let's see if they do it. No, they Whoa, go deep. He's got his man. Number 12. <laughs> so I'm a lungy. So I'm a lungy scored on that uh, two-point last, conversion. The, and uh, last touchdown. He's a quarterback from the championship team of the junior the, varsity junior last varsity year. Last year. Yeah. Son of my uh, classmate. Yeah, he went to Canonaful Elementary, and I had the uh, a fortune of coaching him in flag football, and he's a good player. You've been coaching a lot of... He, he was my receiver, and it's good to see him go back as a receiver. Back to passes. Uh, ooh, Incomplete. nobody around. The nearest player was a Fungai Tua player. And some of the uh, uh, players that are playing for Fungai Tua now, you've coached them from uh, elementary That's as correct. well. And the basics of football is taught through that system. And uh, the DOE, they've put them some good programs on that, and it's helped throughout the, uh, throughout the it years. It really did. And it now did. they got this AYF and this uh, USA football USA stuff. Football. That's even going to help it out uh, more. New player looking to throw. To pass. He's going Shot deep. An open receiver. Oh. Tip. Good defensive effort there by number 25. Patrick Opusili. Patrick Opusili. Oh, this kid is playing both ways uh, today. Patrick Opusili, good anticipation right there. Because that would have been complete because the corner was totally out of position. Is the screen Whoa. pass right here? That was a dangerous throw right there. It was a throwback play. That could have been picked up by the Vikings for six. Number, I, but it's number 25. You could have I think 25 picked lost. It up. I think he took the wrong angle, and the ball <laughs> sailed over his head. But he was looking to pick it up and go for six. That's a clear six because nobody was there. Nobody, no one was there. Looks like the Warriors will punt on this fourth down. Punt they, is up. And they do. It's a high punt, but a short one. Takes a bounce for the Warriors. The 
ball will be spotted at about the 13-yard line. Look at how fast that kid got downfield. Number yeah. 99, Justin. Time out to ya. And with that size, and he's <laughs> running downfield, I don't think I want to stand in front of that kid. That's like a Mack truck coming down the way. Here I am waiting for you. That's right. No room for taxis and those little sedans out there. Even Mustangs. Oh, no, he'll roll them over. First and 10 for the Vikings deep down on their, on their side, side of the field. field. Ricardo telling the late comer there at the play, so that's pretty good quarterbacking and leadership skills. Let's to Loma at fullback. Looking to throw is Gonzalez. No, he can't. He pulls the football Ooh, down, but gets tackled. Stopped there by number five. Number is that Mika? I don't check that. Number five. That's Lalo Asi Tupua. Mika Asi is My number mistake, one. My mistake, number one, yes. Coaching staff there at the Vikings trying to get something going right here. Things have been slow coming on their offensive side and defense. So, um, second man through, gets a call, gets away. Makes a good game. Patrick Opusili. He's got to take care of football and shoot him. Should get the yards necessary for a first down. 91 on the stop, and that's Johnny Fitzimano. It's time out from Aitua, and it is first down. Yeah, but we don't have to go to Aitua. Oh, two more pairs. I'll try to go to Alonga. Tafuna, Luis Fulmontasi. Yeah, <laughs> Here comes the Vikings. Quarterback keeps it. He, oh, looking to throw, but he drops down. Number 51. Pressure by that defense for the Warriors. Minimal gain there by that running by back. Was it the fullback? It is the fullback. Pentito Falongo. Well, that'll bring uh -huh. our first half to an end. That's the end of our first half. With the score, uh, Tafuna Warriors 21, Viking 0. Yeah, my eye now, Tatu Afa Momua. He to Longo Tatu Talongo, Yene, Afa Momua. Yeah, it was from Matasi Ai or Tafuna. Yeah, later I love her. Yeah, I'm here for a two or two five pair. Yeah, that's what I feel like for you. I'm for long law. Yeah, to have a tell of a to name for you. I'm only also. Yeah, to tell you my for you. Yeah, more. I'm telling you that to offer on the law. It's a longer. It's a vow. I'm going to get law for a tour. Yeah, for a pair for you. I'm going to get a long Tafuna. Yeah, to long a pair. Yeah, I'm a for more. It was from Matasi. Yeah. Tafuna, yeah, I like Tawai Lava, yeah. From a tour. I'll say Talonga Matan of fear, Mike. Yeah, too long or Tato Talonga, yeah. A we love our low city tap. I lose for Tassi, Lele. Yeah, I'm on tour, Lele, to a lua tato, what I look to. Tatun boy, what my hat up and I'm a sooner for ya on my family tour. In the town finger for a laugh, a tino for my boy, in a most town woman. Well, welcome back, American Samoa. Uh, second half will. Start momentarily for uh, the game between the Fungai Tua Vikings and the Tafuna Warriors. The score remains of uh, Tafuna 21 and uh, Fungai Tua Vikings yet to score. To uh, restart our second half, the Vikings will kick from the west side of the field, whereas the Tafuna Warriors will receive and return from the east side. That's, a, that's, that's pretty tough for Fungai Tua right now because their defense is going to have to come back out again. That's Kicking true. Kicking the football. And uh, the Warriors will take over, and uh, momentarily uh, the Vikings will kick it away. Let's see what they do. It looks like they're still in that bunch formation. That's a traditional onside, onside kick formation kick for the Fungai Tua Vikings. So uh, perhaps they might want to start something interesting here. Tari tari etra, tari etra, tato talonga, fatari fungai tua, atu porangai tua tafuna. 
It's a it's a pooch kick right there, but taken cleanly by the Warriors. And number 75. It works to Fang Aitua's disadvantage right there. <laughs> then the Mayava for uh, the Vike of uh, the Warriors, brought down by Tausolia Fasavalu. I admire, number four. I admire the effort, but perhaps it would have been better if they kicked it on the ground. 